Oh, you're still here, huh? Great. There's one more thing you should know about the Sylphs. They don't take kindly to guests who show up empty-handed. They're in their trust. You'd do well to uh, bring along a... Uh, uh, rat. What was it again? You and my wife Rosa were... <laughs> My wife Rosa and I were just speaking of the matter not days ago. Forgive me, friend. Speak to Rosa at the comb. Her memory should prove more reliable than mine own. Now, are you married? Because you're showing a lot of uh, dementia symptoms here. Deal dealt with probably more than my fair share of dementia in my time. Not on my side, just you know, people in general. Ah, Rosa Hawthorne, you have the same last name. A peace offering for the Sylph, or at anyone else, I'd recommend a jar of honey. But I fear that wouldn't get you past our front doorstep. Yeah, no, no. Their taste runs more unusual. Are you perchance, uh, perchance familiar with milk root? It's what we call the root of the most fiendish seed kin, the ochu. When chewed, it exudes a cloudy liquid said to induce curious visions in the imbiber. You'd not catch me dead trying this stuff, but the sylphs seem to enjoy it to no end. Uh, let's see. I've seen, I've not seen an Ochu around the comb in quite some time, but I did encounter a suspicious clump of grass the other day. Were you to stimulate it somehow? With some of this amber syrup, for example, you might be surprised at what comes out. Good luck. I, uh, am I being pranked right now? So, uh, to recap... The Sylves are murderous tricksters who eat the sun, uh, do psychotropic drugs, and something about tentacle beasts and the curious tussock need to be stimulated with amber syrup. You know what? This is getting a little weird. Milk root. So you bite this milk root and it squirts milk into your mouth. It makes you hallucinate. I. Hmm. I feel like there's a section of the internet that might be dedicated to the lore of this particular veggie. We will not discuss it further. Ah, oh, you're back. My wife was able to direct you uh, uh, to a suitable offering. Yeah. Milk root, but of course, those silks quaff the cloudy stuff as quick as I do. As I do a flag and a mead. The effect's just about the same as well. Any road, a gift of milk root will have the sylphs calling you friend and brother the moment they lay eyes on it. Now let me wrap that up for you. I'm starting to feel a bit woozy.